J Birds, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna be having a seafood boil. Yes, a seafood boil. So, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a delicious, delectable video. Also, comment, leave me a, a, a comment, I talk back. And share on all your social media sites. As well as if you enjoying what you're seeing, go ahead and hit the like button for me. Thumbs your girl up. So today, family, like I said, we're going to have a seafood boil. Um, I have here with us some cucumbers, bell peppers, red and yellow. I have lemons and limes. I have us uh, some crawfish. Um, blue crabs. I have potatoes. Sorry about oh. the color. I put them in the boil when I was boiling my seafood and I shouldn't have did that. I should have left them out, but I know better now. So I won't do that again. So they'll stay white, but they're still edible. They got flavor to them because I put the um, crab boil seasoning into the pot when I was boiling it. And this is what I came up with. We also have some beloved smackalicious sauce to dip it in, okay? So, yeah, we're going to get that in today. Matter of fact, let's get a thumbnail. I already did, but... There we go. Okay, so I'm going to give me a napkin so I won't be dripping everywhere else. Up under me right here. And me some on the side, so I have my hands together. Today we're going to be drinking some sun-kissed strawberry lemonade. Let's go ahead and get that poured up. Y'all hear that? I hope y'all can hear that. Okay, let's get us a drink in. Okay, now let's say our prayers so we can start to taste the fine. Amen, amen, amen. Now I do have me some, um, dang, I forgot, sriracha hot sauce. I'm going to put a little bit into the beloved sauce so I can make it. A little more spicy, okay? Mm, I'm already getting filthy, but that's okay because that's what seafood balls are. Filthy nicks, so we're going to do that. Mm. I'm going to take this to stir it, then we're going to get started. I'm going to bring this closer. Okay. Let me give y'all the first bite. First bite. My turn. Mmm. The color bell peppers are sweet. Mm-hmm. Let's go ahead and put some lemon juice all over our seafood. We're going to put more as we go, but... Okay, well, let's start with a shrimp head on, pink Argentine shrimp. Mmm, that's good. I have a bag over here, guys, so I can throw my little scraps in. Mmm. I want to put my sauce up here so y'all can see it. So let's just put all the vegetables and stuff over here. And we'll put the beloved sauce right there. Can y'all see it? Okay. Y'all want a bite of this shrimp? Get y'all some. That smack delicious sauce. Mmm. Mm-hmm. 
I forgot to put my phone on. Do not disturb. So I hope I don't get no cows or nothing. But yeah, guys, how you doing today, Jay Birds? How y'all doing? Well, I hope. We made it through this snowstorm, didn't we? No busted pipes this way. Lights didn't go out. Thank you, Lord. I think I think this house is on the grid with the VA hospital. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm. Cucumber. Potato, the small red ones. They red, small red potato. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. I didn't use too much of that seasoning for the crab ball, so it's not too salty. Gotta be careful with that stuff, it's salty. Mmm. -hmm. You got to be careful eating these so you get potatoes, you get full real quick. So I really want to do my plate this weekend, but the snow didn't allow that. Mm -hmm. Come on. Let's get into this crawfish. Mm. I bought these fresh. They were alive when I bought them. The crab, too. Mm. Fish meat. Mm. Mm -hmm. They really fresh. They were alive. So how you guys doing? What y'all eating and sipping on? What would you like to be eating? Comment down below. Tell me what you would like to be eating, eating or what are you eating and enjoying with me right now. And if you're not, go ahead and get y'all something to snack on and I'll be right here. Just keep me come right on back. Just a little. Eggs. I know they dark, y'all, but they was in that ball. I shouldn't have did that. Mmm. They got good flavor, though. The flavor seeped in there. Mm. Oh, the egg yolk. Nice and yellow. Mm hmm. Y'all 
like eggs with y'all balls. I do. Yes, Lord. So have y'all failed y'all taxes yet? I ain't even got around to it yet. I'm probably going to send the stuff to her tomorrow, though. I don't know, I eat my ball seafood. I mean, I go in. Seafood is my favorite food in the world. I don't play when I'm eating it. See, this is how you get the that string of crap out of there without having to tear up your foot meat like that. You just pinch the tail. And, um... It'll come right on out. These are really fresh, y'all. They were they really good. another shrimp. Yep. So what y'all doing this weekend? Oh, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Mm. Yep. Mardi Gras coming up. Mardi Gras. I want to do something. I want to do something like, I don't care if it's just go to a restaurant. And eat seafood and crawfish and stuff with, with people. 
I just want to do something though. The crop is good. Getting the juice out the orange, y'all. This one does it too. Okay, let's get us some crab. Now, you know, this is a crab ball. I cleaned the mess out. This, I have all the stuff Louisiana put in there. So I put uh, some extra cloves, uh, seasoning, and uh, spice in there. I like oranges, lemons, what was boiled in there. You can use. You can pretty much use any citrus, um, whether it be oranges, tangerines, mandarin, grapefruit, limes, lemons. Uh, you can use them together in your seafood bowl. A lot of citrus is good. Seafood tastes good with citrus. So today I use oranges and lemons. spicy too y'all that's just um like the seasoning and stuff don't stuck to the meat like this the meat i put extra cloves i put um oh bay the garlic flavor all that in there mm. plus the um Crab bowl seasoning. That's my delicious sauce. Good. Um, it's the last of the batch I made, so. I probably have to make another batch. Finish my crab. I cleaned one and one I left home. 
It's actually with just a crawfish boil, but I just added the other stuff. To make it look more full. Yep, so I ain't gonna be talking that much on this one, y'all, because I'm still trying to put food in my mouth. So if you like videos where it's not that much talking, just all eating, this the video for you. Because I ain't gonna be doing that much talking. And I got all this seafood. Um, from Fiesta. Mmm. I taste that lemon juice. I spray it. Mmm. Yeah. Mm. It's spicy, y'all. It's Mardi Gras uh, month. Y'all see that mustard? That's the head mustard. <coughs> yep. the seafood ball. Mm 
Yeah, I'm supposed to put this fine on Do Not Disturb. I forgot. It's probably going to be a pretty long video. I got to get up and check to see where the video is. Because the reason why it's looking so good right now is because I have the phone turned around the opposite way. Where I can't see the screen. It's the back of the phone that's recording. Which shows a better picture than the front. Because it's like four different uh, lenses on the back. So... To get better lighting, that's what I had to do. But y'all gonna be proud of me. I ordered a ring light. <clears throat> um, it comes with a trip a tripod for my camera, and it comes with an extra tripod to put my phone on, and I can set it up correctly so it'll light up right. So yeah. I hope they work. I just think really what's going on is that the fact that the front, uh, the back records better than the front because of the, how many lenses back there. I really think that's what it is, but we're going to see. It should be here next week sometime. I also ordered a mic. So, yeah, I'm trying, you know. A little alone, be patient, get everything in. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. My bad. Get food point, huh? I'm bad pepper, good. One second, let me check where we at. We 28 minutes in, but I knew this was going to be a pretty long video because look what we eat. But if we still record. I'm just trying to make sure it hadn't cut off. Okay, let's get us a potato in. A potato in. Ooh. Look at her. 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 Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. That's the skin. Hmm. I see that. Mm-hmm. Oh, That sriracha made it extra spicy. It's good. Mm. This is sweeter than the yellow.
You know, I've been on playing that shit out, but I'm just be, <laughs> I'm gonna be polite on her. Cause I, I don't really waste my time. Ooh. I see the head butter. Mm. Yep, that's good. I tell you now, I'll get it Which I thought I was playing for Valentine's Day. Me nothing. Nothing. I think I had a boyfriend or a significant other once during uh, Valentine's one year. But I'm usually single around this time. But I'm single on purpose right now. I've been single for a long while now. Ever since my um, last old man passed away, I've been in not in a relationship. So, I don't really think I'm ready for one no way. I'm still fine learning how to, you know, with with my therapy and all it. Learning my how to grieve properly, learning um how to love myself, uh learn my self worth, my value, learning how to communicate assertively, trying to control my temper and my damn attitude. So, you know, I'm still working on me, child, and trying to grow a business. So I ain't really got time. I mean, I'm waiting on God. Let's just put it like that. I'm waiting for my boys. Boy, is it Boya? Boyza? The one in the Bible. <laughs> I can't pronounce that right. Never can. I don't want this uh video to be no hour, y'all. That's why I say my heads from when I'm by myself off camera. I'm just eating my tails, finish my tails. Oh, this one wanna give me a hard time. That's fine. Let's pop this bad boy open. Okay, so this is a boy. 
because he has a long thing on him, a long apron. So that's a boy. Okay, once you pull the apron off, with your finger under that little crevice right there under the shell, take your other finger in and just rip it apart. Ooh, see? You just rip it apart. Ain't nothing in there. This not no girl, so ain't no eggs in there to eat. So most of the stuff in here, I'ma clean up and, and discard. You gotta get rid of the fins. See them fins? You don't eat the fins. The gills, should I say, that they breathe with their lungs pretty much. Okay, let me just break it in half like that. And continue to clean it up. Get the mouth off, okay. Okay, see? Now it's all clean. So I mean y'all like seafood And who's allergic to it Because I know some people have allergies to it I'm so thankful I don't <laughs> I'm so thankful I don't have no allergy to it
A lot of y'all probably already know these are the crabs you usually put in gumbo. I mean, you can put regular crab legs in there because I have, I do too sometimes. Or oh, I put both. Yeah. Use the gumbo crab. Mm, I see this car. This one right here big too. You see it? That's a big old cloud, ain't it? Yeah, this is real good. <clears throat> Perfectly seasoned it. Open up my sinuses, my airways, all that. Bring it up. Yeah, it's, it's, it's what's up. I like me a good seafood bowl. Let's see if we can get the lollipop out of here. Nope, we didn't get it. I am breaking. I ain't let me out. Oh well, we finna have to do it like that. It's all that meat.
I thought y'all were going to do that much talking. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoying that. My mukbang. Go ahead on and get out of here, love. It's so good though. Okay, we're gonna eat one more shrimp. I think that's how the shrimp we got left. We're gonna eat both of these shrimps and we're gonna go. Okay.
Oh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Oh, this is real good, though, y'all. This is delicious. And they're going to be on my plates, too. But I'm telling you right now, I'm just going to make one dish at a time until I build up my clientele. Then I start adding stuff more, more, you know, as I get customers, I start making multiple things in one day. I just don't want to have a whole lot of waste, wasted food. Which it will be wasted because, you know, I... I'm known for going to South Dallas and feeding them people, feeding them, giving them people food. I give them food in a minute. I'll take them some food. So it won't be wasted, but. In the food business, you got to watch your overhead. You got to watch your overhead because it'll sink your business quick. Food, go <clears throat> food going up too. So you really gotta watch your overhead and inventory and just gotta be mindful of those things. So that's the way I decided to do it until I get more clientele. Once I get me a, a certain amount of number of clientele, I start adding one more thing to the menu with that one other thing. But this gonna switch up anyway. This might be the same thing week after week. Like one week it might be gumbo as a specialty item and then uh, something else and then shrimp and grits as a specialty item. That kind of stuff, you know. Anyway. Ooh. Math on fire. Math on fire. <laughs> okay, I ain't even eat my other egg, but that's okay because I'm gonna be hungry again in the next couple of hours and I'm probably gonna eat this. <laughs> I'm I know I'm gonna eat it. If not this is salad and say to eat this tomorrow. Now I don't know about y'all. If I eat seafood too late, I have really bad dreams. Weird, weird bad dreams. Ooh. And cleanse your palate. Woo! Okay, guys. All right, family. Well, I ain't gonna hold you guys any longer. If you enjoyed what you watched today, go ahead and click that like button. Thumbs your girl up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and click that notification bell so you'll be uh, reminded every time I upload a wonderful delectable dish. Also, if you could share this on all your social media sites, share, 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 tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. I would greatly appreciate that. And leave me a comment. Drop it down below. Talk to me. I talk back. Now, if you stuck in, um, stuck all the way in with me to the end of this video for this seafood boil, then I want you to put down in the um, comments below one of the um, emojis for any seafood you want. Octopus, lobster, shrimp, crab, either one. Just drop a seafood emoji down in the comments if you stuck with me to the end of this video now i just want you guys to know that i love you so 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 much also remember that god will never put more on us than we can bear so you be encouraged thank you and until next time bye